right, meantime, we bring it back closer to this team here at home, and I've had a lot of people messaging me, what do I think of the kids' chances making the team? I like them. Right now, I've got him penciled in on my opening night roster. I look at the way he's played. He's looked comfortable. He's probably been one of the stronger players so far in camp. And, you know, there's a lot of expectations on this kid to make that jump. A lot of fans, management hopes he can make that jump. And right now, he's living up to all that hype. What say you? Let's check in on what some people are saying here on the text line. I got... And a couple of other the roster races that we've been focusing on hey it's been talked about to death it started before camp before the physicals for that matter can the rookie crack the roster can he make the team this youngster a lot of anticipation there's one game to go and i'll tell you what i would be shocked i will be shocked if he's not on the opening night roster He's been that good. He's been very good in my mind. I don't think this game is going to make a break based on the body of work that I've seen from him so far. Doesn't hurt if he plays well, but I think he's... Now, when we start trying to project what this roster is going to look like on opening night, I think the real shock here for this is look who made the team, right? I mean, when you are picked where you are, especially later in the draft like this, and for the youngster to kind of come out of nowhere as a rookie to seize that moment, make the team and have the impact he had in camp, huge props, major respect to that youngster right there. We're going to try to get him on the show, I think, here sometime in the next. All right, everybody, I want to bring it back to the rookie here for a second. And, you know, I know there's a lot of hype and a lot of buzz. And, you know, we've seen kind of mixed reviews with a lot of freshmen breaking into the league over the last few years, right? I mean, you look at some of these guys with the hype trying to make that jump, and they're kind of underwhelming debuts. Some set the league on fire. Look, I, I really think they've got a chance to see and have something special with this kid. I, I've really liked where his game's at. But I would also say this, let's not panic if he gets off to a slow start, right? It's his first year in the greatest league on the planet in the sport of hockey, right? So let's let's just maybe temper our expectations. If he doesn't have 50 goals in the first 20 games, let's not write him off as a bust. But I am very confident that they have got a special player in this young man. He's a forward. I think he is born to score goals, and he will find a way to light the net very quickly in this league. Uh, a lot of people jumping in on the text line here, weighing in with their thoughts. I am so intrigued to see how things play out for this young rookie with his first game in the NHL and, and just how he responds, right? I, you know he's messaged everybody, every single contact that he's got in his phone book. Uh, he has probably texted or called and ready to roll. Uh, now you see how he rolls in this sort of situation, right? A lot of anticipation. Think about anybody's first job, your first day on the job, right? Man, I think even when I was flipping burgers as a kid, my first day going in with... We've talked enough about him. It's time to find out if he can actually do it on the ice. Razor, any final thoughts? Well, I think his thought is that he wants all this talk to be over, James. Everyone has asked him questions. Are you ready to play? Can you play at this level? He's nervous. He's scared. He's excited. He can't wait to get on the ice. It's time to do what you do best. Just go play and show everyone. set to drop the puck on this season. So 
Pirelli set the face-off dot, ready to win this draw on the man advantage. The Bolts win the face-off. Hammers it! Quick stop by Shesterkin. There's always a next level to making a save. Step two is get the puck out of danger. He does a nice job there. Oh, and that's poked away in the offensive zone by Goodrow. Denies him in close. I like the goalie's positioning here. He was aggressive enough to make a save on a dangerous chance. Takes a shot. Tremendous stop by Shesterkin. The Rangers cross the blue line and are on the attack. Kalorns moving it ahead. Puts it on net. Oh, he just got enough of that to keep it out. Slides it up to Kalorn. He almost lost it for a second there, but regains control of the puck. Kalorn's got it along the wing. The Rangers gain possession. Streets picking up steam. 2-1, breakaway! Denies him on the breakaway! Really good speed to get out in front, dust the pack. Now it's him and the goalie, but the goalie's better. He makes the stop. Denied by the goaltender. He reads the play to get across in the butterfly, but you still have to be agile because that puck can change directions on you. And the puck leaves the zone going back to center ice. New York's got it now. And he regains control of the puck. Oh, what a save in front. The Bolts have it behind the cage. And somehow he hangs on. Couldn't catch up to that pass. You want to score. You want to get on the board. Here's a chance for him. Quick pass to Maroon. Here we go. Pucks in deep. The Rangers gain possession along the wall. All alone. Big time stop. Nose to nose. The goalie comes out better on this chance. Oh, and another stop. Really sharp, never loses sight of the puck to make the second save. Moves it around along the half wall. Here he is on the backhand! Look how happy 
everybody is around him. The rookie gets his first career goal, and he gets to celebrate with the boys. Ray, as a rookie, how long did it take for you to score? It took me three games, and it was a great thrill. I can't even imagine what this feels like. Feeds the puck up to Panarin. And he slides it quickly to Street. Score! zipped around, they can attack low, they can use a point shot. Really hard for the penalty killers to catch up and they just couldn't this time. They've been on quite a roll as we send it back between the benches to Ray Ferraro. Man, momentum's a funny thing, James, and they've got it right now. The puck is in the net, then it's in again, and then it's in again. They don't want this to stop and the coach is reminding the rookie to stay on it. Still lots of time left in the period. The Rangers have taken the lead here over the last few minutes. They'd love to build on it. Oh, what a chance here! 2 on 0 And he stopped that one. No room for the shooter. The goaltender snuffed it out. Time to roll. Six minutes. The Rangers have it against the wall. Here he is with the backhander. Makes the save as he gets a piece of it with the glove. Look at this attack here in the O-zone. Carrying it. Carrying it. And they'll skate it out of the zone. Poked away at center by Streak. Can't find his man. The Rangers will play it against the boards. Grabs the puck and looks to make something happen. Streak's able to take that quick pass. He's already got a couple of goals. He's looking for a third. Deflected away. Nice defensive use of the stick there. The Bolts look to start the transition game. Puck picked up by Point. New York's got a hold of it along the wall. Works it across to Zabinishad. And look at this, it's a parent all alone. And he came up with a solid stop on that play. That's flat out reaction, James. That puck is coming at the goaltender from the low slot. There's not much time to think. Position, score! And there's the this James he gets himself into the low slot in good position and then he zips a backhander past the tender it's pretty rare when you play a game and in the middle of the game the coach gives you a pat and says you're doing a great job but the rookie has been excellent tonight James he got an assignment early we heard him talking to the coach about it and he's delivered he's been absolutely excellent we call his name a bunch tonight Still a lot of time left in the period as we approach the midway mark. New York's really controlled the pace of play these last few minutes, leading by two. Oh, he had the right idea, but couldn't make that play with the pass. Makes the save with the foot. The Bolts will play it from the defensive zone. Oh, and that's poked away in the offensive zone by Zabinijan. Tremendous stuff by Vasilevsky. Oh, and that's poked away in the offensive zone by Zabinijan. Denied by the goaltender. Tampa Bay's got the puck along the boards. Denies him with the blocker. What a stop by Vasilevsky. He's been really good on these high danger chances. And here's another one right from the slot. But he's tracked that puck to keep it in front of him and make the save. Hedman's a solid player in the D zone, guys. His stick em up zone ability means he can use a timely poke check to disrupt his opponent's attack. And now it's to Panarin. Here they come on the attack. Tosses it on to point. Here's a short pass to Kalorn. The Bolts played along the boards. The Rangers, look out, here's a 2 on 0. Oh. Nothing doing. Tried to make the perfect shot. Doesn't execute it. Slides into Perry. Gets the puck in deep. New York's got possession of the puck. And it's a 2 on 0 -oh break. Score! Once he saw that 
that open room, James, he just motored away from everybody. He makes no mistake to score on the breakaway. James and Ray with you tonight. More than half the period has been played. The Rangers now lead by three. Puck is dropped, and we are back underway. Sends it ahead to Street. On the back end! this all the time. I'm not even surprised anymore. That puck is delivered fast, crisp, and it's flat. Easy pass to handle. Officials getting ready to drop the puck. Puck possession Rangers. so key in today's game. Maintains possession. Oh, and it comes up in the big stop there. Wide of the net. Oh, man, he's frustrated with himself. He's got to get that on the net. Puck sails out of the bench, sending a few people ducking. Slides it over with pace to Panarin. Nice pass. Headman pass. Toe saver. Was that the blade? No, regardless, tremendous. Elliott's able to make that stop, but man, this is not an easy gig. You're sitting over on the bench in a ball hat, and all of a sudden, you got to replace a starter in goal. Vasilevsky's a great goalie who can steal a game for his club. Levesque's good at giving his team a boost when he scores. It's his born leader zone ability, and they love to rally around him. Be on the lookout for one of these players to make an impact for their team tonight. Now, let's send it back upstairs. A chance for the shorthanded unit to clear here. Yeah, they need a gasp here, James. They're burnt. The Rangers going to work on offense. They score! <laughs> season ahead. Well, things are going from bad to worse. The first goalie sitting on the bench in a ball hat. This guy can't stop the shot either. Puck is dropped. Play resumes. Oh, look at this. Here they come. They've got numbers. Backhander. It's in. Goal means one goal on the board, but some just mean a little more because the guy that scores it's one of your leaders. Everybody is up on their feet because they're pumped he scored. Quick feed to Hedman. Poked away in the neutral zone by Zabinijan. The Rangers get a hold of the puck along the boards. Oh, a clutch save! Oh, and that's poked away in the offensive zone by Zabinijan. Couldn't make the connection on the play. New York's got the puck along the wall. To the front! The Lightning have gained control of the puck in their own zone. And now it's over to Perry. And he slides it quickly to Kalorn. The Bolts carry it along the wall. And that pass doesn't go. Picked up along the boards by Perry. Can't connect good use of the body on that play. One on one with the goaltender! Huge save on the breakaway! Really good patience in net by the goaltender. He outweighted the shooter and then made the stop. And a great read to turn that play aside. Makes a move in front! Denies up with the blocker! What a stop by Elliott! He scores! Scores goal right there. That puck is on and off his stick in a hurry. He's so tight to the net. He has to get rid of it before the goalie can readjust. And the centers glide towards the dot here as we got a face off set to go. New York's won the draw in the neutral zone. Huge steal in his own end. Can't make it work. Tries to the pass. The goalie's not going to like this, mainly because that turnover right in front of him doesn't allow him to get set. He gets beat down low. That 
concludes period number one. I cannot believe they got one of the all-time great 90s hip-hop acts getting set to play for the fans here in this intermission. I can't wait for this. We'll come back to period number two in just a bit. Here we go. Period number two is underway where it is too much to not enough here. Well, this one underway. Ray, give us an update on what your assessment is to this point. The Bolts are going to wear themselves out if they don't get control of the puck pretty soon. They've had no possession time virtually at all, and they're trailing in this game. No one back at 2 on 0 And he comes up with a big stop. I can't do it better than that, James. That's a great stop. Tampa Bay's got the puck at the defensive end. And he takes the feed. Taken by Hedman. Pass broken up. Cuts into the paint. Scooped up along the wall by Panarin. Flushes the leather. What a save by Elliott. Elliott's one of the group today for sure. It's not been very good from him all the way out. Musa quickly over to Street. Spectacular stop by the goaltender. How did he hang on to that? Big save by the goaltender once again. But he came out and challenged a good save. Play blown dead. Let's get the call. You're almost at the point where the clock can't move fast enough. Down by a bunch and now shorthanded. Be much puck movement on this set. We've seen them use this before. It's the two big shots from the point, traffic to the front, and if there's a rebound, up man the personnel around the goalie. Moves it up, and a huge stop by the goaltender at point blank range. Moves it to Street. Moves inside. And that powerful goal to the earlier one. I mean, this passing is crisp and sharp and on the tape. And then the score gets the puck with a chance to finish it off. Do you continue to press here with the lead raiser, or do you try to play it safe? Well, it's a fine line, but the coach is reminding the players that safety trumps everything else. If a play's there, make it. But for the most part, they want that puck in front of them and playing a defensive posture. The Rangers have reminded me of that old cliche here, Ray. When you're hot, you're hot. It's a point night now. Everybody looking for points and goals as they are just clearly the better team tonight. New York's going to play the puck from behind the cage. And they're off to the races. It's a 2 on 0 here. Shuts them down on the breakaway. Really good save as the shooter thought he had an opening, but it's turned aside. Official signals for the players to get into position, and we're about ready to drop the puck. Center's jammed up, and the winger grabs the puck. Cutting to the front of the net. Big time stop by Elliott. Read of the play was perfect, but it's his quickness that gets out tight to the puck, so the shooter can't elevate it anywhere. second domination right from the very beginning of the game this is now an absolute landslide for them new york's game plan is being executed to perfection i love the way that they're playing tonight gaining steam here on the attack oh they probably want to redo on that gives them nothing in front Elliott's gonna cover up the puck here for a whistle he makes a safe play and kills the play before any other damage can be done Finishad's won the draw. Oh, he'd like to have that pass back. And he lays out to block that one. Goes right to the crease. Oh, and it's just wide of the net and they'll play on. 
He's going to shake his head when he sees this because he's, he's in as good a scoring spot as you're going to get to all night. And he just misses the net. And look at this. All sorts of pressure here building. And they've got it in their own end now. Grabs the puck. Shot. Oh, great save right there. Elliott's going to smother it to get a whistle. Can get dangerous if nobody's in control of the puck. The centermen glide into position. Quick pass to Zabinishad. And it's a quick pass to Panarin. To his teammate. Sensational stop with the stick by Elliott. There's another great save. Shooting that snapshot while you're on the move is a real difficult thing for the goalie to keep up to. As you're moving, you're changing the angle with every shrine. Tampa Bay's got a hold of the puck. Comes up with a monster save in front. New York's got the puck in the corner. Stopped by the goaltender. There's another consecutive save. Oh, he's on it there. Both saves are really good ones. Points won the draw in his own end. Now let's see if they can clear it. Oh, and that's poked away in the offensive zone by Zabinijad. Can't get a hold of that pass. Oh, and that's poked away in the offensive zone by Street. New York's got the puck behind the net. Oh, what a stick save. Yeah, he gets out on top of the shooter. There's really nowhere for that puck to go. New York's trying to make something happen in the offensive zone. And off the side of the net it goes. Tampa Bay's got it in their own zone. Quick pass to Perry. Poked away at center by Street. And now it's grabbed by Hedman. Quick shot! Turns it aside with the glove. Puck grabbed by Truba. Oh, what a chance, and it goes sideways. about his luck. Well, phone lines are open and text messages already hopping away. What a job. What a performance. What a debut by the rookie. I mean, to snipe in your first NHL game, you talk about living up to the hype. There was a lot of pressure, a lot of eyeballs to see how he would respond. And to me, he passed the test with flying colors. Whatever that even means, flying colors. I'll tell you what, he aced it, love it. Uh, and I think there's a lot more and a bright, bright future ahead. Uh, meantime, we're gonna check in on some other stories going on around. Game show continues, phone lines are up and running and they are jammed up. So is the text line as well. I haven't seen it hopping like this in quite some time. And what can you say? Everybody wants to talk about the kid when he causes a hat demonium, if you will. His first career hat trick in the NHL as he lights the lamp. Th Let's bring Ray Ferraro back into the show. Afternoon, sir. How goes? Uh, very good. I mean, maybe not as good as the rookie who might be channeling. Remember that old uh, classic TV show that had that theme that went moving on up, right? Yeah, it's a great day for the rookie. I mean, you got to think that there are days that are better than others. and. He's walking into his first game playing on the top line. Uh, this doesn't happen all the time, of course, and he's played well enough to, to earn this spot. And the, the first